If you want to know the best comedy TV shows, you should definitely watch our picks for the best ones of 2023. You burst into my office and raw dog me here? Stop saying raw dog. I can say anything I want. Tell him what raw dog means. Number 10. Obliterated. Created by John Hurwitz, Hayden Schlossberg, and Josh Heald. This action-packed series follows an elite special operations team in Las Vegas who, after a wild night of sex, drugs, and alcohol, discover the bomb they neutralized was fake. Now they must fight through their intoxications to find the real one and save the day. It's a comedic blend of suspense and dark humor where every moment counts in a chaotic race against time. I've just been hooking up with this guy. I don't know if he's like a drug dealer or something. I, I don't do that shit. Actually, relax. We're gonna get you someplace safe. You just sit down. Wait, you're leaving me here? <laughs> Number nine. No, I am not talking to it. I'm eating. Will you take a photo of our family, please? Mrs. Davis is a science fiction comedy drama miniseries created by Tara Hernandez and Damon Lindelof. With an over-the-top absurd premise, but a lot of action that never takes itself too light, this nun's journey is set in the future but reaches a thousand years back. In a future where everyone uses a personalized AI called Mrs. Davis, nun Simone is told that she should find the lost Holy Grail and destroy it. But nobody knows what Mrs. Davis has to do with it. Does that make sense? You're yeah, like a ventriloquist dummy. Well, that's not very nice, Simone. What do we say? I don't... Sorry. It's all right. I forgive you. Oh, I was not asking for your forgiveness. Let's begin. Number eight. Twisted Metal. Created by Rhett Reese, Paul Wernick, and Michael Jonathan Smith. This series follows a motor-mouthed outsider given the chance at a better life, but only if he can deliver a mysterious package across a post-apocalyptic wasteland. With armored vehicle battles and a motley crew of characters, it's a wild, adrenaline-fueled journey, perfect for those who love high-stakes, eccentric storytelling, and a uniquely twisted sense of humor. Like it with the beat go? Dana, dana. Baby, let your booty go. Dana, dana. Girl, do you want to show? Dana, dana. Ba -dong, ba -dong, ba -dong, ba -dong. Do you love the silver-haired god? <laughs> Number 7. Extraordinary, created by Emma Moran taking on the superhero genre in the form of a parody that is not only warm-hearted, but will ignite your love for the show in seconds. Extraordinary is set in a world where everyone gets a special power at the age of 18. 25-year-old Jen, however, never got hers, but armed with a bit of hope, a lot of desperation, and her flatmates, she begins her journey to find her maybe superpower. I can summon sea creatures. Can you command them? Um, no. Number six. I'm Kate's imaginary friend from when she was a kid. Boyfriend, really. I thought I had to jerk off. Gen V is a superhero television series created by Evan Goldberg, Eric Kripke, and Craig Rosenberg. This gripping story from the world of The Boys explores the first generation of superheroes aware that their powers come from Compound V. At a prestigious university, they push their physical and moral boundaries in a fierce competition for the top ranking. Blending action, moral complexity, and dark humor, it offers a fresh, intense take on the superhero genre. Diddle that skittle. Flick the bean. Better find that man in the canoe. She came like a faucet. She'd crank up the Jonas Brothers. She'd hump a soldier boy pillow. She'd raw dog that pillow till she saw God. Gross. Number five. Poker Face, directed by Ryan Johnson. This Mystery of the Week series follows Charlie, who has an extraordinary ability to determine when someone is lying. Traveling the country in a classic car, she encounters a new cast of characters and strange crimes she can't help but investigate and solve, making each episode a unique whodunit. The blend of mystery, crime, and road trip adventures ensures a captivating, suspenseful watch that keeps you guessing. Fucking millennial! I'm a cusper, you fucking psycho, and I draw the line at fighting little old ladies! <laughs> <laughs> That's how we did it in Bedford, bitch. Number four. Shrinking, created by Bill Lawrence, Jason Segal, and Brett Goldstein. This story about the power and dangers of radical honesty follows a grieving therapist who knows that the truth is not always justified and that the problems of patients require understanding and a lot of care. But when his own grief becomes too much, he starts to tell his clients exactly what he thinks, resulting in huge changes to people's lives, including his own. Your husband's a fucking tool. 
I'm sorry, but he has the energy of an 80s movie villain, you know? Like, he would definitely sweep the leg if he was commanded to by a sensei. Well, it never stops. And I do everything. Like, all he does is make coffee. Number three. What is your problem? What? Beef is a black comedy drama television series created by Lee Sung Jin. This provocative and wicked smart social satire explores the harrowing consequences of a road rage incident. It unravels a twisted feud that consumes its characters, jeopardizing everything and everyone in their lives while exploring their shared humanity and collective hardships. With thought-provoking storytelling about meaning and purpose, this gigantic web of revenge delves into the complex human psyche as the two venture into surreal situations. Gotcha. Number two. What do people usually say when they're trying to like get out of this? Like what's like the move? Like Jury Duty is a sitcom television series created by Lee Eisenberg and Gene Stupnitsky. Outrageously funny and over the top absurd, this parody of reality TV sees a bunch of strangers called for jury duty. But actually, they are all paid actors and actresses in a fake court scenario whose goal is it to make a mockery of the entire thing, except one guy who is told that everything is real and that he must focus on performing actual jury duty. I, um... I... 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 Sir. I'm, I'm, I also am uh, racist. Sir, please have a seat. I'm sorry, you're a racist? Before we unveil TV show number one, here are some honorable mentions. We're gonna have fun wherever we go, even if it's a strip club. And I for sure wanna keep hanging out if we go to another spot and you guys all wanna go to an all-nude strip club, I don't wanna be the guy who's like, let's not go to an all-nude strip club. So it's unanimous. Strip club! Strip club! Got Dang. it? Thank you. Man, this is actually very easy. We could do this ourselves. Ugh, what do we need you for? Okay, fine, you do it, I quit. Good riddance. See ya. Oh yeah, fucking spoiled TV host can film her own TV show. Damn, you f***ing Looney Tune, you got a dead body in there or something? <laughs> yeah, <laughs> this. I'm gonna call it over. Number one. This guy here, you don't know what Luffy needs? I know he needs my cooking. You mean putting two slices of bread together? One Piece is a fantasy adventure television series created by Matt Owens and Steve Maida. This faithful live-action adaptation of the beloved manga follows Monkey D. Luffy and his crew, the Straw Hat Pirates, as they navigate treacherous waters and uncharted lands in search of the ultimate treasure, the One Piece. It's a visually striking series that combines intense action, humor, and a spirit of adventure, making it a thrilling ride for both new audiences and longtime fans of the epic saga. Do you agree with our list? Please let us know in the comments. If you want to know more about a particular TV show in this list, you can check out our links in the video description. And for more top 10 TV show videos, be sure to subscribe to Community TV.